Now, thousands of businesses deemed non-essential like tourism companies, restaurants, and fashion designers are still closed due to the coronavirus, and many don't make the cut for government assistance either. So what do these companies do? Well, joining us on Skype now is Elinoy Kislov, founder and owner of Graffiti Yule Tours and Workshops, a company that unfortunately has had to close amidst the coronavirus crisis. Now, first of all, thank you so much for being with us. Your business has been operating for seven years and it employs about 20 people. How long have you been closed because of the coronavirus? At least a month, maybe a month and a half. Wow. And what are you doing in, in that time? How are you dealing with that? So at the beginning, I was very optimistic and I started organizing things. But now I understand that the situation is not getting better and it's going to take a long time for tourism to get back. So I actually started a virtual tour and hoping to find my way to make my business survive. So actually, that, that was my next question. You know, I understand that you found a very creative solution to continue your business operations uh, uh, to some degree, uh, this virtual tour. Can you tell us more about that? Yeah, so the idea is that uh, people can join and can uh, go through Google Earth with us and find some really unique places and hear the best stories, at least in my opinion, and get some inspiration of what graffiti artists, for example, did when they were on a crisis and how they managed and hopefully to give inspiration for people today in this situation to find their ways to be more creative. Now, now the Prime Minister and the Minister of Finance announced assistance for businesses uh, and, and discounts as well, allowances, grants. Are you receiving any such assistance? No, not at all. Um, apparently, people who own companies don't deserve anything. And also, I realize if I'm going to look for someone to help me, I'm probably not going to survive. So I realized I have to help myself. Wow. So uh, how, many, how many employees do you still have now that you've gone virtual? To Are be you... honest, I had to let everyone go. Wow. I cannot afford to have anyone now. Wow, that's terrible. Uh, and, and uh, you know, are, are, are you still offering the full amount of tours at least or anything close to that? I mean, what kind of tours are you still running? Just graffiti tours? So now I'm running only the virtual tour. There's no one to join on a regular tour. And from a business that we had 150 tours a month, we have zero right for today. So hopefully now when we have something virtual, maybe now we're going to mm. maybe get to some business. Wow. All right. Well, thank you so much. And, and I wish you good luck in the future with your tour company. I, I hope you bounce back. Thank you so much for being with us. Thank you.